This is a tree. Trees take away CO2 and turn it into oxygen. There are 3 trillion trees on the face of the planet. We cut down the world's population of trees every year. If we keep this rate up, we won't be able to breathe in approximately 32 years. My name is Josh Williams and this is Gus Sippel. We've discovered a tribe in northern Montana that holds rituals to respect the spirit of the trees. And why are they starting these rituals? Sources say that this tribe is angered by the effects of corporations terrorizing their spirits. And we're here to figure out what has led them to all this anger. But first, we have to talk about trees. Trees are essential to all human life on Earth. If it wasn't for trees, you would not be breathing right now. Forests absorb one third of all CO2 produced, the gas that we breathe out for oxygen. Gus and I are headed to the streets to see if any of the public is aware about this disaster. Let's go. Hi, Hello. are you aware that trees absorb one third of all the gas that comes out of your mouth? What? <laughs> Hello, uh, we wanted to know if you were aware that without trees absorbing CO2, we would all suffocate. Oh my God, no way, I can't believe this. Am I okay? Can I breathe? <laughs> uh, you may not be if the trees keeps absorbing it. Oh my God, what do we do? As shown, the general public is pretty oblivious to the importance of trees and how they help us to live. We found that 80% of the world's biodiversity can be found in forests. Such an essential part of the world should be preserved. Animals of the world depend on trees as well. Statistically, 70% of all land animals live in forest regions. Without this vital habitat, many living animals wouldn't be able to survive. Examples include monkeys, owls, koalas, even bunnies. This applies to plants as well. Without protection of the tree's canopy, many flowers will wither and die. Birds, they're not just cute. In fact, many of them are going extinct. Eight species of birds have disappeared this decade alone. 10 to 21% of all birds will be extinct by 2100 due to deforestation. One of these birds in danger is the Galapagos penguin. Due to the increase in greenhouse gases, many tons of ice caps are melting, effectively destroying their habitat. But the worst part about it is that for the large majority of us, it's not our fault. One of the main culprits, big business. Companies like JBS cut down over 120 square acres of forest each year. Owned by tycoons such as Jose Batista Sabrino, who named his own company after himself. What the heck? What an egotistical maniac. AgroSB, another deforester company, has been accused of illegal deforestation. Coincidence that CEO Daniel Dantes focuses most of his attention on Peru, where 80% of the deforestation comes from illegal activity. These companies are accused of keeping their workers in slave-like conditions and spraying forest sites with pesticides. Effects of industries are far-reaching. Deforestation costs $4.5 trillion a year through the loss of biodiversity. With no remorse of the indigenous people, animals, and environment, Industries are wreaking havoc on our precious trees. We've heard from local sources that the indigenous people are holding a ceremony tonight in these forests. Gus and I have decided to go investigate these matters. Josh, no! Do you know where Josh went? God, where am I? Wait, who are you? We are the indigenous tribe of Montana. What? You have angered the spirit of the trees. You don't understand, we're against cutting. Enough! Our tribe leader demands a sacrifice. of us. Wait, Gus? Gus, wait, where are you? I'm right here. Wait, where? Right I, here. I can't hear you. I can hear you. What? 
That's where, big where? water. I'm right here. Where are you coming from? Uh, tree. What? Um, hello? He's, He's right, right there, there, idiot. Behind, behind you. you. Oh. Oh. oh, hey, Josh. Hey, Josh. Silence. Because you take our trees for granted, you must die. Bye. Paper cut. Brother Thomas, if you will. Let's go, Josh! It's been three weeks since the event in the forest occurred. Gus and I were contemplating not even finishing this documentary as he has moved away far from here. I did, however, get this final clip after that night occurred. Many people do not understand the effects that deforestation has on our lives. It has certainly impacted mine forever. <laughs> Action. He's, He's right, right there, there you idiot. idiot. Behind you. Don't look at the camera. <laughs> Action. Silence, because you take our trees for granted. It's <laughs> fine. We're gonna go past this guy. He's aware. That's CO2. It's harming our environment. That pretty big one. Excuse me, sir. Sir, are you aware that trees take away one third of the air that we're absorbing in our mouths? Sure. You are? <laughs> He knows! <laughs> we have learned from local sources that the indigenous tribe is holding a ceremony tonight in the forest. Gus and I have decided to go investigate these matters. <laughs>